It's a well-known fact that the world is changing, so I did some investigating into a case where a man divorced his wife because he said she was lazy and she couldn't satisfy him anymore. It turns out that marriage laws have been passed in three states where marriage between a man and a teddy bear have become legal. Yes, legal. Between a man and a teddy bear. Well, after gathering some information, I tracked the man down and got a hold of his wife, the teddy bear, and asked her some tough questions. It was a tough interview, but I got through it. I pulled it off. Okay, okay, so tell us here. Um, you're the first teddy bear to ever marry a man. Uh, how does that feel, uh, ma'am? So you're not going to talk to me. Is that what this is? I see, I see. Do you think this is some type of a sick joke? You think this some type of a game? Listen, it's, men are not supposed to marry stuffed animals. It's wrong and it's sick. And you're just going to sit there and say nothing. You know, I, I can't, I can't, I can't, I'm sick of this. I'm sick. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. After realizing the conversation was getting nowhere, I had to keep probing the teddy bear with tougher questions on why hundreds of men were turning to them, stuffed animals, for love. One man reported that all his wife wanted to do was fight. She never cooked or cleaned, and he was sick of it. He ended up going out with his daughter's teddy bear and soon fell in love. Unsolved mystery. Well, it turns out I tracked down one of the men who did not want to be identified. This can be scary. Why a teddy bear, sir? See. Teddy bears don't talk back. I can do whatever I want, you know, and uh, my teddy bear wife says nothing, you know what I'm saying? Some, sometimes we, you know, we even go on double dates. I can even bring girls home, and me and her, she, she just lies right next to the teddy bear, and. It says nothing. It's, it's the best relationship I ever had. It's pure. You know what I'm saying? I think every man should uh should get a a, a teddy bear as his wife, uh, and I'm glad they legalized it. No, no. What do you mean? It's pure, sir. Well, there's no diseases. You see, I mean everything is safe. No child support neither. That's the uh, that's in itself. That's like a a two for one deal at the. Fast food restaurant, you don't get no child, you get to do whatever you want, you don't get no child support. It's safe, you know. But the teddy bear does nothing. Yeah, and I, I think that's sexy. I think that's sexy when a teddy bear does nothing. You know, when a, when a bear just sits there, there, there and, they, and uh, there's always a smile on his face, I love it, you know. It's cheaper too because they don't eat. Right. Okay. As you can see, the world is changing. I don't know if it's changing for the better or for the worse. Maybe 10 years from now, who knows? Teddy bears may be able to reproduce. This is Bob Love signing off. Have a good week, everybody.